All right. If you own the forward blue laser machine, we're going to show you something else that this laser machine is good for, and it's not only for back glass. So stick around to the end of the video. We're going to show you some really cool stuff that you can do with this. It may not engrave, but I'm going to show you something really cool, and it has to do with refurbishing if you are refurbishing. Okay, we have a iPhone XR display, and what we're going to do is, on our tester, test to make sure the display is good. Obviously, the glass is broken, as you can see. So this would be a good display for refurbishing. We're also checking the touch just to make sure all four corners of the screen, so to speak, that the touch is working. As you can see, just about everywhere. Check the corner there, corner there. It all seems to be working fine. So. I'm going to show you something that you can do with the laser machine. Okay, we are right back at our laser machine and that screen that we just tested, I mean, we actually wrote on there, good 10R, good LCD. And what we did here is we got the flex cables and turned them inward and just put a little bit of painter's tape. You want to use something that doesn't stick too much. What you're doing is basically holding it so when we burn the edges, the purpose of the laser machine also is that we can help uh, with the adhesive around the framing when, you, when you're about to do refurbishing. And what we did is we don't want the flex cable to be leaning over this way because as the laser burns on, on the front of the screen, it could actually catch those flex cables. So make sure you bend them towards the inside, tape them down real good. You're gonna put it down similar to the way you would do back glass like so and you're going to use your rod and make sure that you have this have the space okay i just let it come down a bit i see that my screen is bending a little bit so you just don't want to bend it too much so it can stay even that should be fine right there so we're just going to tighten it and you can see the screen gives a little bit you just want to make sure it doesn't bend too much and you can push it up a little bit let's see and we might actually want to do it on this side here okay this is another tip for you do it on the side where it's more sturdier <laughs> instead of doing it in the middle, okay? And then you're just gonna tighten there. And it gives a little bit, but that's, that's fine. It's not a big deal. Once you have that done, make sure it's tight. And then over here, let me get you a better shot. So we're gonna select carving, and then we're gonna select iPhone. And we're doing the LCD, not the back, so we're going to select LCD. I don't know why it's asking for black or white. Let's select black. And then we're going to look for our model. Let's see if we can find it there. 13, 13, 14, 6, 6S, 7, 8, there's an X, and there's a 10R. So this is the one we're using, 10R. Then it's just going to ask us if you want to proceed. As soon as you select figures, it'll start working. We'll show you now.
Okay, as you just saw, the laser machine, you see that little gray line there? What the laser machine did basically is run a laser just on the border around the screen just to loosen the adhesive that's connecting the frame. So when you're refurbishing the phone, the frame comes out a lot easier. I know may, many have damaged their displays removing the frame. That's why you always want to test uh, through every single process of refurbishing. So we have our tester here and we just ran it through the, through the laser as you saw and we're going to go screen by screen and show you that everything is A-OK. -okay. And here's where we can test the touch and we want to get to like every single corner of the screen, top, around the sides, bottom. Okay, so that means the touch is working just fine. And you want to get this area up here just because they're easily or can be easily damaged when you're using your wire. You can try different colors. As you can see, every surface of the screen looks fine. And then you want to check all your colors, make sure there's not any display dots or anything like that. You got your reds nice and bright, your green, your blue. Just like you can see on the connections, you want to make sure. Actually, this cable was a little loose when I put it in there. But anyway, you want to make sure that when you start removing this frame, that it comes out nice and easy. And as you can see, it's a there's our how we labeled it. iPhone XR with a good LCD. So this LCD is good. We as you saw, just ran it through the laser machine just to loosen the framing around it. So that should be able to come out nice and easy when we start refurbishing it. So we just wanted to show you another tool that you have in your forward blue laser machine that you may or may not have been aware of. If you are refurbishing, go ahead and give it a, a, a try. Just remember as a tip, tape these flex cables over. Don't let them hang out like this because then you, your, your laser might actually hit them and then uh, you've destroyed your, your display. So if you haven't started to refurbish, it's something you might want to look into. I know locally here, Mike and Jace are doing training. I personally know them both. So reach out to them if you haven't done so already. Check them out. Give, I'm giving them a shout out. Reach out to them and they'll be able to help you out with your refurbishing training. Until next time, Please don't forget to subscribe. Hit that subscribe button below. If you give us a thumbs up, that would also help promoting our channel. See you next time.